Hello everyone! Today I'm going to be explaining the phases of the moon. The phases of the moon is where you can see the moon's surface being lighted with the sun's light. And the moon doesn't have its own light because it's a non-luminous object. The moon is actually using the sun's light. The phases of the moon is also known as the lunar cycle and it happens every once a month. So the first stage is the new moon. The new moon is when it is between the moon is between the earth and the sun and the other side of the moon is actually being lighted but since we only see the same side of the moon every day uh, we can only see the part where it's uh, no light <laughs> next we have the waxing crescent this is where we start to see a little bit of light from the sun then we have the first quarter. This happens when it is the moon is 90 degrees uh, with the sun and only half of it is uh, lighted. Next, we have the waxing gibbous. Gibbous means more than half and since the sun's light on the moon is more than half, it is called waxing gibbous. Then we have the full moon. The full moon is where the moon is directly facing the sun and the sun's light is present on the surface of the moon and the other side of the moon is actually dark. Then we have the warning gibbous. This is the phase where they start to uh, have a little shaded part because the moon is revolving around the earth. Then we have the third quarter. The third quarter is just like the first quarter but the shaded part is on the other side. Then we have the warning crescent. The warning crescent is when you can only see just a little bit of, sun's, of the sun's light on the surface of the moon. Then you go back again to the new moon. And like I said, this happens in once a month. And I made this project with clay for the shaded part over here and the earth with the paper felt. So that's all for today, children. So I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. Bye.